guys, Mr. Backberg here. In this video, we're going to look at finding the volume of spheres. So as we're looking at finding the volume of a sphere, just like we used the radius in order to find the surface area of a sphere, we're also going to use the radius in order to find the volume of a sphere. And the volume formula for a sphere says that we do 4 thirds times pi times the radius cubed. So as we look at this first example, we're given a sphere with a radius of 5 centimeters. Looking at our volume formula, we're going to do 4 thirds times pi times the radius cubed. So I filled in my 5 for the radius. Now in our calculator, if we take 5 cubed, that's 125. And I would just take all of this and type it into my calculator. 4 thirds times pi times 125. When we do that, we get 523.60 if we round to two decimal places. We should throw a label on this. Our measurements were given to us in centimeters. So we're going to put centimeters on the end, but this is a volume, so it has to be centimeters cubed. Taking a look at our next example, this time our sphere has a diameter of 4 inches. In order to use our volume formula, we need the radius. So if we cut that four inches in half, we have a two inch radius. So we take four thirds times pi times two cubed. Two cubed is eight. And then I would just type this into my calculator, four thirds times pi times eight. When we do that, we get about 33.51. And we're gonna throw our label on the end. This was given to us in inches. So this is inches cubed, since we're talking about volume. That's going to be it for this video. Thanks for watching.